On this episode, we're changing the oil and filter 2011 BMW K1300S. Greatest motorcycle of all time. You're gonna need a drain pan, oil filter, maybe oil filter wrench, eight millimeter Allen for the drain plug, oil, of course, drip rags, some polish in case you want to clean something. And then here's the important part, cling wrap. Go borrow this from your wife or whomever. See, this has been in the shop for a while. This is important, no drips. First, this is oil filter, right? Down here is your exhaust. So, you can take off this body panel to get better access, but you don't need to. You get your cling wrap, and then what we're gonna do is, we're gonna slide it down in here and put it over the exhaust and drip it down like so. It's also okay, even though unlikely, but it's still possible. That way it doesn't drip on the inside of the fairing. Take off the seat. So this is your sight glass tube. It tells you how much oil is in the bike. This is also how we drain the sump. So there's a little squeezy tab over here. It's kind of hard to get to with your fingers, but it is possible. You're just gonna squeeze it. And pull it up. Like so. Squeeze here. Pull up. And then we're going to thread this thing down to the drain pan. And the oil is going to flow. Careful, there it comes. So pop the top. And then just let it sit there. But it's going to take a while for this oil to drain out of this little bitty tube. So it's a good idea to have two drain pans. So this is our drain plug. For the motor. This is the eight millimeter Allen head socket. So your drain plug has a magnet on it. And the motor's pretty much done. So we're going to back this off a little bit, just in case. 
And then if you need to, you take your oil filter wrench Slide it up between the inside of the fairing. And then you can get to the oil filter. Give it a turn. And we definitely needed it. Bros, it's not necessary to put the oil filter on to 100 foot-pounds. We may be able to... So, get your cling wrap positioned and then we're going to back this filter off And there it goes. So that's what the cling wrap is for. So while that's done, what we're getting now is just drips. So we're ready to put the new filter on. You can use whatever oil filter you like. I'm using this one because it's easier to remove the next time. And it comes pre-lubed on the oil seal. So we just slide it down in here, spin it back on. three quarters of a turn for when it makes contact is all you need okay oil filters on motor is done draining so now what we want to do is just get our cling wrap and roll it over the top. And we're good. For any drips and spills, a little brake parts cleaner. No burning oil smell. Get your washer, put it on your drain plug. And then we're going to torque that to about 18 to 20 foot pounds. And over here, the sump's still dripping. So we'll wait for that. Start a timer. So if you do this first, you'll know when to come back. 
So 14 minutes and 44 seconds after I started the timer, we're down to drips, right? So our sump is empty. We're gonna take this, thread it back up. It goes behind the brake reservoir. And then there's a spot. Where you can manipulate it through right here then it comes back up and then just pop it back on until push it till it clicks clicks good right so we're fine so the oil draining filter is on oil plug is in we're good Move all this shit out of the way. So we're gonna put in about three and a quarter quarts. Now, when you look at the sight glass, it's above full. So start the motorcycle, let it circulate. Check for leaks. See where it pulled the level down? Level slowly dropping. back up just a little bit so now we're going to add oil to get it in between our marks fire it up again So that's four quarts on the money. We're, we're at the halfway spot. Your motorcycle's content may vary. So go back and double check. Tighten the oil cap all the way down. the seat back on oils changed filters changed we wiped it down while we were spending 14 minutes and 44 seconds waiting for the sight line to drain now it's time to put it on the ground, put on our gear, go for a ride. Thanks for watching.